also working new details tonight on the controversial pension reform plan that could reduce the benefits of all current and past Rhode Island state workers. One day after, Governor Chafee and Treasurer Raimondo unveiled their plan to repair Rhode Island's broken pension system. Retirees tell us they're worried about making ends meet should the plan actually become law. At the crux of the plan, raising the retirement age to 67 for workers born after 1960 and eliminating annual cost of living adjustments. Today, retired workers we spoke to tell us the plan amounts to a broken promise from Rhode Island to its employees. Highway to Sue's reporter Sean Daly joins us now live with reaction from those who will be affected by the changes with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom. Whatever happens at the State House with this pension reform legislation, there almost certainly will be a fight about it at the courthouse. The cuts they're proposing. These are the faces of fear. Three retired government workers furious that pension reform plans are promising pain. They're going to try to steal my future. I worked more than 30 years to earn that pension. Uh, it, wasn't a, it wasn't a gift. It wasn't a promise. It was a contractual arrangement. They're taking away something that I was promised when I worked and when I retired. That's what I was supposed to get. The, uh, they want to take away the COLA. And uh, I worked for it. And when I retired, I figured out I got out a pen and paper and I figured out how much money it would be. I decided when to retire based on that. And now the state's saying, well, we changed our mind. For retired workers, the pension reforms as proposed would mean a double whammy. No cost of living adjustments on top of higher taxes. I'm also a taxpayer. So whatever is going to hit, is going to hit me as a taxpayer plus me as a retiree. I probably would not have retired at the same time I would have if I had known the state was going to do this. You're saying, in effect, they're changing the rules in the middle of the game? Yes, they are. And that's wrong. Because people have made, not only me, but many people have made decisions based upon what, they, what the rules were. Government workers aren't the only people who are upset about the pension proposals. So is a local mayor. We'll check in with him, new at 6. Live with the West Bay Mobile Newsroom, Sean Daly, Eyewitness News.